What's happening, Jig Heads? Welcome back to the channel. Today I'm going to be talking to you about colors I use in dingy, murky, muddy water when it comes to crappie fishing. Stick around for the action. Oh man, first cast back out, another fish. Water clarity, guys. Important thing to take into consideration when you're out fishing. That is what we're after. Another big fat mama. We'll put her back, let her do her business. All right. Tight quarters today. Tight quarters. Whoop. And you don't want to put it in a tree. That ain't where we want it. Flipping her down the bank. We're fishing shallow. I want to pop one right there, I think. Yep, there he is. Good fish. Yep, a little male. Got that tuxedo on. I don't think he's going to quite make the cut, but we're on him. Starting the morning off out here pretty early. You got it, y'all. It's dirty water time. Springtime, you get a lot of rain. Dirties up that water. Gold is my favorite color. Throwing the brush hammer from brush pile jigs. 16th ounce. Catch them jig heads. It's got a number two hook with a wire keeper, and we're about eight inches under a float. Single jig rigging. All right, we're gonna try and go back further into the frickin' brush here. Right? Boom, boom, and then nothing? bit more room to cast right here anyway all right we're gonna drop this float a little deeper pop two fish early right off the bank those are the only two fish I found so we're gonna adapt drop her down to about maybe 18 inches of course I got to keep the rod tip out of the tree There's fish. Went a little deeper. This is a good one too, y'all. Just hope it's a crappie. Might be a bass. Nope, that's a toad of a crappie. <laughs> Dude, this is a giant. Yeah, look at that one, y'all. That's what we're after. Made a little adjustment. Dro dropped her down 18 inches. Boom, popped us another one. That's a dandy fish. She got some eggs in her, I think we'll let her go. See if we can't get over here and smoke us another one. There's another one. Yep. All right, they're just a little further off the bank than what I'd thought. A little yellow bass. That ain't really what we're looking for, but it gave us a nice little fun fight. Pound for pound, these little boogers are tough fighting fish. Wonky hook sets. Trees everywhere. Fishing in the bush today, guys. Another good one. Another freaking yellow bass. We must be on a school of these down here. Got a school of yellow bass down here, Zip. Yeah. Ain't nothing wrong with catching fish, even if they ain't what you're after. There's one. I do believe this one's gonna be a crappie. 
Yes, sir. And it's a dandy. Hoo -hoo -hoo. Giant freaking slab. Tight quarters down here, guys. I'm sorry. Camera angles aren't going to be the best, but check that beast out. Tanker! <laughs> that is what we're after. Another big fat mama. We'll put her back, let her do her business. Here she is, y'all. You gotta let these big mamas go back to breed. Take care of your population. All right, y'all, a little information on the gear that I'm using today. I've got the seven foot six ACC crappie sticks split grip casting rod. Great rod, especially down here in these tight quarters like this. Real limber, has a great backbone for flipping those fish up from the water. Got that teamed up with the PC Fun Viper X 1000, spooled with some vicious six pound high vis mono. And like I said earlier, disco gold, baby. Brush pile jigs, check them out. Oh man, first cast back out, another fish. Another crappie, not quite as big. I wish I had a freaking saw. I'd knock down some of these trees right here. There's one. Yep, that's another good fish. Another freaking yellow bass. And them yellow bass pull hard. I should have been putting them in the freaking bucket. They eat good. Oh, well, we'll get him back. It's a mixed bag today, y'all. Crappie, yellow bass, springtime. Great time to get out and get on some fish. They're excited just like we are that the weather's warming up. In their case, the water temps are warming up. And they get out and about, take a little stroll around town, you know, hit some jigs, sink some floats, bend some rods. But you ain't going to do it sitting on the couch now. Water clarity, guys. Important thing to take into consideration when you're out fishing. Let the water clarity dictate what color plastics or jigs you're throwing. Make sure you know which colors work best in certain water clarities. I actually did a video out on that last year. And I'll drop a link to that in the description below so you guys can check that out. Till then, I'm going to catch some fish. I think this is another yellow bass, and it is. That's all right, little multi-species action. Knocked her sideways on me. There you go. Yeah, that's a good male. Get out from the tree. That's a nice looking fish. What do y'all think about that one? Pretty little tuxedo on, pushed up shallow. Gotta love it. Yeah, we'll get down here and get him turned loose. There he is. Oh yeah. That's another good one, y'all. That's what we came here to look for. We'll swing this one up if we can. Another big fat mama. Not quite as big as some of them other ones we've got so far this morning, but another quality fish. Getting on a lot of white crappie down here. This little area of the lake that I fish, this, uh, this, this spot holds a lot of white crappie. It's funny how the white and black crappie do that.
opposite end of this lake, which is a lot deeper. I find a ton of black crappie. Over here on the shallower side of the lake, I find all the whites. And I ain't no expert, so I don't know why that is. If one of y'all know, drop a comment down below and let me know. Oh, that's a good fighting fish there. Yellow bass. Yes, sir. Dang, that one's a freaking tank. Look at the belly on this thing. Look at that, y'all. Pudgy. I'd say they're up here probably getting ready to spawn, too, would be my guess. And they're just mixed in with these crappie. So all around, fun time. Them yellow bass pull like a freaking freight train, man. Oh. I do believe that one's a crappie. No. Another big old fat yellow bass. Simmer down now. Better flare them gills up. They're angry. There's one. It is. That's one of them fish with the specs we've been looking for. Running probably about nine and a half inches, just a little short, but another good fish. All right, y'all, I'm wrapping this one up. Had a great time down here this morning. Kind of a mixed bag. Got a lot of yellow bass and some really good crappie while I was out here. Hopefully some of that information I shared with you on the colors I use during springtime and muddy, murky water help you out on your next trip. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button while you're there. And remember folks, you can't catch them sitting on the couch. I'll see you on the next one.